people describe it as a peace or kind of a joy or, or sort of a divine essence. And it, it seems to be generated not only by the, the nature here, the land, um, the location, the peaceful, beautiful island, um, but also by the, the, the temples and the, the monastic community here. Which is uh, the largest bamboo. This is the Wailu River. This is the Hawaiian Ganges. They regard this as This is Irivan Temple, and it's inside of a small monastery. Uh, we call it Kauai Adhinam, or Kauai's Hindu monastery. And it's a traditional Adhinam, which means a monastery which has connected to it a temple. And we had challenges of uh, finding the skills in India to do this work by hand because one of the demands of our guru was that this temple should not be built with modern tools, but should be built with the skill set of sculptors a thousand years ago. And that's how it was, in fact, put together. But now it exists and it's like a pilgrimage place, the way we look at it, because there's not that many Hindus in this community. The Hindu temple is devoted to God, whom this denomination of Hindus calls Shiva. Okay. So that's the basic idea, is that um, all, the, what I like to say is all Hindus believe in a supreme being, we just don't agree on the name or the nature. <laughs> so. There's always one that shows, right? <laughs> Day going back to his temple in Colorado, he said, I want to share that only the monks live on the property. That's very important. And to become a monk takes a few years of training and study. So those living on the property are of a certain caliber of discipline. Each monk has a little 10 by 10 by 10 block hut out in the jungle. That's where you sleep and meditate. Um, so you wake up in the morning and you uh, walk into the main buildings and then you, uh, the first thing you do in the morning is attend uh, worship in our temple here. Yeah. You should, you should, oh you should. Sharing his vision of Iravan Temple with Ganapati Stabadi. Oh, not to share. Anevarum, Mande, Povila, Mande, Sutti Park, and Nuno Rama, Swami, and the Derisan of Pananuna, and the Inna, our Mahaling Yasura, Vendu or the Vendu Marangala, Alipar. Uh, only here I can feel it. I think because of the monks, they created this last 50 years, 70 I think they started. And I think that is the main thing. 
the rishis, the saints and sages, the way we had in olden times in India, in the Himalayas. I see them here.